Hey, what's up everybody? Gary Roth, City Guy in the Country here. I have a big, <laughs> a big smile on my face today because uh, I'm, I'm excited to try a new little product. Now, I'm going to say this thing and I want you to hear me very carefully. This is what I have been told is called a jigger hose. J-I-J-G-G-E-R. Hard J on that. Basically what it is, is it's a self-priming siphon. Supposedly... You can take this into a liquid and shake it a few times and it will start to siphon and save us all a lot of trouble. Now, you may have heard the phrase, kill two birds with one stone. That's what I'm trying to do today. The old 966, we got it filled with enough hydraulic oil to, you know, to run and shift and do the transmission and use the uh, hydraulic remotes in the back. However, comma, I will say, that the steering is very sloppy which is a known problem here because inside of here is uh the multi-control valve this handles all your steering hydraulic and stuff like that and inside there if that's not completely submerged in oil there's some o-rings and things like that that can get air cause suction problems and all that stuff and you can bleed it the first remedy that i read about in multiple places is just overfill your hydraulic case and it should solve the problem by keeping everything submerged and no air can get in there. So we're actually going to try that with the J-I-G-G-E-R self-priming siphon. And of course, a trusty uh, five-gallon bucket of hydraulic oil for my friends at Bumper to Bumper. So let's go to the other side of the tractor and see what that looks like. All right, let's go. Okay. Hopefully you can see me. You might just be able to see my head. I apologize. I will work on that for future episodes. Okay. Should have had this ready, but I didn't, and I don't. So, here we are. Oh, crap. Okay. I guess I don't get the neck to pull out today. That is all right. Oh, hydraulic hose. Or excuse me, hydraulic dipstick. I wonder, I wonder if they've been doing that a lot because some guys were saying grind off your dipstick. I don't know if that's true or not. It sounds kind of funny to me. All right, let's get this in here first. Supposedly it works on oil. <laughs> I'm really excited. I hope this works. Okay. So there's that. Let's get that in the oil all the way down to the the bottom. And you're supposed to just shake it. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> hey, it's working. <laughs> it is working. All right. if I can get off here without falling on my butt because of all this dang oil on my hands. I don't know if you can see it, but it's flowing, albeit very slowly, but it is flowing. So let me get cleaned up and we'll let this pump down and see what it does. Well, all right, friends. Uh, <laughs> good old tractor so a couple things number one the jigger hose did work okay it does work but with that oil and that's not really very thick oil that hydraulic oil it's only 20 weight so you know i don't know would it work on a lower weight oil a little bit better probably it does work don't get me wrong there's a link to it in the bio these things would be really great around the farm or around the house anytime you need to siphon gas or like if you're like you and you get like five gallons at a time for your zero turn lawnmower Go down to your store, get your gas, set the gas on the lawnmower, do the do the hose and get it going in there, and you don't have to sit there and fight and hold a gas can. Not only is it gonna be safer, it's gonna be a whole lot easier. Save your back for something important, not holding up a heavy gas can. The other good news, uh, steering is tight, all right? Steering's nice and tight. That overfill trick uh, worked. It seems to me like everything works a little bit better. The hydraulics were a little bit tighter. The, uh, I'm looking through there. Hydraulics are a little bit tighter, steering is tight, 
and then uh, it seemed like it was going in and out of gear uh, a little bit easier too. So hey, if you got an old 966, I guess just uh, <laughs> you know just overfill everything. So anyway, uh, things are good here out on the farm. I guess I better go and work on these pesky floors. Uh, Chiefs play tonight. I'm a big Chiefs fan uh, here in Central Missouri. Uh, always have been, and it's nice to see them doing well. So I think I probably should get some work done. I hope you're doing well. Again, uh, grab you one of those hoses. They are effective. They're great for pumping out gas of a boat or a car. I mean, anything. They're, they're, it's just great to have around, and uh, it's kind of fun to use and watch. So uh, there's a link for that down in the video description. Uh, every purchase you make is a little bit, it's an affiliate link. So I get... I don't know, maybe 10 cents for every one that you buy. So it helps the channel a little bit. I appreciate it. And uh, a lot of us in this one, and I'm sorry for that. This was kind of an impromptu video. Hope you're doing well. Love you all very much, and have a good rest of your day.